morning, hello, how are you doing? I'm back. I've had my little social detox, there was a lot of things, we'll get into it. But I'm happy to be back, okay? I'm filming, I've got a camera out. I don't know what we're gonna do today, but you're coming along with me, okay? <laughs> Let's fill you in actually, because I've not actually spoke to you in a fair old minute, have I? So, I can't remember the last thing I told you. Mmm. I remember, you remember all the water heater palaver drama, blah de blah. It's fixed. I've got a water heater and I now have hot water in the kitchen and washing machine area. So that's fixed. I did my annual exams. I passed them all first time. I'm so proud of myself. And what else is new? I went to Australia. I went to Melbourne. Didn't take us with me. I went to... Where did I come back from yesterday? I went to Dublin. Didn't take years with me. Well, I did try, but didn't really do anything when I got there because it was a bank holiday weekend and I didn't want to face the crowds of people going into a city centre, town centre, whatever you want to call it. So no, didn't do anything there. Ended up just starting to read my book. Oh, I'm reading a new book. I'm reading um, Caught a Silver Flame. I'm finally reading it. I'm only on like chapter two. I haven't read much. But yeah, that's where we're up to in life. It's a Monday today, actually. And I think I'm getting a delivery today of new bedding. And I'm so excited. You don't understand. I've ordered, like, satin sheets. My hair and my skin are going to feel great because I currently sleep with satin pillowcases. Obviously, curly hair. You should do it even if you've got straight hair. Get some satin pillowcases, girls and guys. And then I just started researching it, seeing what's best to sleep in. Um, and everywhere said whole sets, so I ordered myself some satin bedding. I assume it's satin because I did not pay enough for silk. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, hopefully that arrives today. And then I think that's all I'm going to do today, actually. I've got, obviously, go to the gym. Oh, I've not been to the gym in a fair old minute. Yeah, I don't want to burst the bubble that I've been amazing and I've been looking after myself. Hell no. I had a McDonald's yesterday. It was great. Loved every minute of it. It was fantastic. It was also one of those days where, no. <laughs> it was also one of those days where I landed at half eight in the morning. Um, got home around 10 and I was out for the count. I was supposed to film yesterday and get you to spend the day with me. One of those days that nobody wants to see. Cause you actually really enjoyed that last time. Don't understand why, cause I was just complaining the whole time. But yeah, I didn't in the end because I woke up actually pretty late compared to what I normally wake up at. So we're here instead. It is a Monday morning. I have, what time is it? 20 past 11. I've been up for a fair old minute. I think I woke up about seven. But my dilemma in life is I hate going to the gym. Ideally before one. I've realized my happy spot is around two o'clock. I'll go around 12 if I have to, which I think I might aim between 12 and one today but my happy place is at two o'clock because it's just empty i can get on the machines i need there's no like crazy amount of people in there i can just enjoy my space there's no queue for the treadmills all that fun stuff back to what i was saying so with everything that was going on with the bloody water heater i told you that i wasn't cooking not because i can't cook i can cook i uh, just didn't feel comfortable trying to wash dishes in the, the bathroom and I tried the whole getting a bucket of water, taking it to the kitchen. It took far too long, so I didn't do that. Um, so we're back on the cooking grind. I need to meal prep. Probably going to do that as well today. But I don't know if I want to meal prep or just make my chicken curry that I used to make. I haven't made it in a long time. If you've been around here for a while, you know it was like my favourite meal to make. And it's really high in protein. But that does mean I need to order some chicken because... I don't really like. This is like me just weird bumming on you, by the way. I hope you don't mind. Um, I don't really like the chicken from the supermarket. I buy it from the butchers instead. Butchers? I assume it's a butchers. I'm not actually sure. Either way, I have to order it through an app. Gets delivered same day, so it's fine. Very pricey. But it actually tastes like chicken. And I know that's like first world problems, but I need to eat. If I'm going to eat chicken, I want it to taste like actual chicken and not just produce water when I eat it. Hope you understand what I mean by that. We are getting ready. What type of skincare do I want to do today? 
we'll do this one. I'll use the Elemis one. You know, I love it. I've still got so much of it left and I use it every day. The only days I don't use it is when I do full makeup for work because I have a different one that I use. I don't know if you're supposed to put this on underneath, but I just use the, what's it called? The Bobbi Brown something or other primer. I can't remember. I just put that on, but I don't know if I'm supposed to put this on underneath as well. I'm not sure. I might try it. Oh, I love the smell of this. Oh, it's May, yes. We're in May. I've got my flights for this month, obviously, because we're already in the month. And I've got some interesting ones coming up. And I've also got leave. I'm going technically to the UK, end of May. I've got a wedding that I'm going to. It's my cousin's wedding. Um, and you're coming with me. So yeah, I'm gonna spend the weekend in London. So we're obviously gonna travel to London, get a flight there direct instead of going to Manchester to drive home to then get in the car and drive. I actually was debating it. Can't lie to you, I was debating that. But I'm just gonna fly to London instead. <laughs> it makes more sense. I go to London for the weekend at the end of the month. Wedding. I've got a dress and I tried it on yesterday and I actually really like it. And I'm hoping it's going to be the one that I'm going to wear, but I do have, I think, two or three more getting delivered today that hopefully might be in the circuit of being worn as well. Circuit? Yeah, you get what I'm trying to say. I'm still not sure what I'm going to wear, but I've got shoes and I've got a bag because I know I'm going to wear white shoes, white bag. Um, anyway, I'm just weird bumping on yours, so I'm going to go finish getting ready. And I'm only getting ready to go to the gym. I just put some concealer on and blusher just so I don't look half dead. I like to look a little bit alive when I go there, even though I get there and just sweat it all off. Mm hmm. Oh, also, I know I've just said I'm going to go, but how cute is this t shirt? It's got a little teddy bear on, and then if you go to the back, it's like the back of the teddy bear. How cute is that? Oh my god, it's so cute. It's actually um, someone's merch. I follow her on YouTube and I really enjoy her music. So when she released it, I was like, I need it. So I bought it and then I also bought a white cropped version. Oh, so cute. But yeah, it's my new favourite gym top to wear. I wasn't going to wear it because it's actually really cute. But I think I am. I want to feel cute today. How many times can a girl say cute? Did I vlog in the gym? No. Did I vlog in the supermarket? Nope. But I've got something exciting to show you. <laughs> you know my obsession with the flora. Yeah, if you don't, hi, I'm Sophie. I have an obsession with the flora and it has to be the Midnight Bloom version. Nothing else. Anything else, I don't want it. No, I found this. It's room spray, basically. It can go everywhere. So not only do my doors smell of it, my surfaces smell of it, everything that I can actually put the floor on, now my room is gonna smell like it. I'm so excited. It was very overpriced. But it was worth it. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you understand how excited I am for the floor. Yes, it was, it was something, but it's fine. I bought that. And then I also thought I'd treat myself flowers. So I got some white roses. Do I have a vase? I do somewhere. Where is it? Oh, it's there. Yeah, I do. It's over there. Okay, I'm going to go put these in a vase before they die, because they probably will die soon, and probably start meal prepping while I've got the energy. Can't lie, don't want to do it. And also, oh my god, I can just smell the flora. It just smells. 
Oh my God, it's heaven. You know, before when I was saying, oh, I might order some chicken, blah, blah, blah. I don't think I'm gonna. Oh, and do you know what else I bought? Which is probably gonna offend anyone who may be Mexican. Um, Cause I'm not gonna use them for what they're for. I bought these, which are the soft tortilla shells. I'm gonna put my rice and my mince and everything in here and put some sauce on top of it, not the sauce you're supposed to use. Curry sauce. Sorry if that offends anybody. Don't care, it's going in my body. I'm gonna enjoy it and I know I'm gonna enjoy it. And then I'll just put my veggies on the side. So yeah, I bought these to try. It's actually quite good because it's only 74 calories per shell, which I think is pretty damn good. And then if not, I can just put like, I've got, what's it called? Taco seasoning in the cupboard, so I can do that as well for some of them. I feel like that was a wasted morning with yours because obviously you didn't see anything, but the gym was insanely busy. Like I went early, I went about 12 o'clock and it was still so busy and I left probably just before two and it was empty. I, like, I knew I should have waited. I knew I should have, but now I've still got like my afternoon because it's only three o'clock now. So I can get everything sorted and enjoy my little night at home, living my best life. Can you tell I've not vlogged in a while? I'm just talking to you for the sake of talking to you because I feel like I've not talked to you for so long. And I kind of missed it. It does feel weird at the same time, like, doing this, but... We'll get used to it again. Don't worry, you little cotton socks. Right. Peace out. actually no idea what this video is what this video was <laughs> I have no idea but I think it was a good way to like get myself back into it I know I've not spoke to you as much I've not spoke to you as much a weird vomit that is every time I've spoke to you obviously I've been cleaning up the apartment today but I've not really showed you much because it wasn't actually that bad I say that that dressing table that dressing table will be the end of me I swear it's clean for about 10 minutes and then it's just dirty again. Not much has changed. I have been cleaning off, like I said, I've cleaned up in here. My parcel didn't arrive, so it's annoyed me <laughs> because I was very excited all day that my parcel was gonna arrive and I was gonna get new bedded and tonight was gonna be the night that I'm gonna live my best life. No, we still have the old bedding on and it's not the silky one, but I do have my silk pillowcases. They're down there. There they are. So eventually they will turn up, maybe tomorrow, I don't know. It said it was out for delivery today, but it obviously wasn't. I think I'm gonna call it quits. I think I'm gonna get into bed. It's about 10 o'clock and I'm gonna put a movie on because I've actually got tomorrow off. So I think I'm gonna do copy paste from today for tomorrow and then just get ready for my flight because I am flying on Wednesday. So when you, will you please be quiet outside? Honestly, this apartment is just never quiet. I wouldn't change it for the world, apart from like a countryside house with a big garden in the back. But it's just never quiet, <laughs> ever. It's so annoying. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I'm flying on Wednesday. So when you see this, I think I'll be in the sky. I think I will be actually, so yeah. I'll see all your nice comments when I land, so please be nice. 
It's been a while since I've been here. I'm a bit rough around the edges, okay? Also, I was watching a bit of the footage back before and I think I speak a lot faster in the start of this video than I normally do in vlogs. I normally slow down how I speak a bit, but I guess I haven't this time. So hopefully you all understand me fine. I know my accent is a topic of conversation around here in those comments. Some people like it, some people hate it. I ain't changing it, it's okay. Anyway, I'm gonna end this vlog here. I'm gonna go get into bed, put Harry Potter on and live my best Monday night life, okay? Living it up in my 30s, that's what's happening right now. <laughs> Give it a like and subscribe and I will catch you in the next one. Bye! Satisfying you I keep leaving